this is Gatala Fish, and I'm going to be talking about the swim bladder disease in fish. Um, so how this guy got swim bladder disease is um, he was having a hard time eating, and then he started eating again, and he got too much food, so now he is bloated and has swim bladder. How you know if they have swim bladder, um, if they have swim bladder or not, is like this guy, they will be just sitting there, not really doing much. So you can see his belly right there. His belly is a bloated. Um, it should be a lot more flat than that. It's a little better than it was before, but it's still pretty bloated. Um, and now he's trying to swim downward, and he's having a really hard time. He keeps on coming to the surface. That's another indication. Um, and this is really easy to cure. Uh, you can either just leave him, not feed him until he's swimming around normally again, which normally takes... Um, maybe just a day or two and they're fine without food for that long or you can feed them a pee to speed up the process just a little part of a pee so I'll show you how I fed him a pee and I won't be feeding him anymore until he's doing better It's been a little while after I gave him a pee. A pee. Um, and he's starting to poop, which is really good. So, he's doing really well. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and let me know the videos that you'd like to see. Hopefully this helps. Bye.